Shalom, beloved. A word. Some people have come to see a funeral. Yes, yes, yes. Here in these lands of the heathens of our captivity, they are thinking it's time to have a funeral. Yes, they want to bury the history of Yasharel. They're banning stories in school, stories of Ruby Bridges. You got a man who has no truth in him. Down there in Florida, just a man who wants to bury the history of an entire nation. Yes, yes, yes. Many people think they've come to see a funeral, to, to bury a people. Mm, mm, mm. But they don't know you're at a resurrection, not a funeral. Yes, the, the word, the word has come to me as I'm reading in the book of Luke chapter 7, verse 11. And it came to pass the day after that he, Yeshua HaMashiach, went into a city called Nain, and many of his disciples went with him, and much people. Yes, yes, yes. There are many people who are watching this foolish nation attempt to bury Yasharel, to steal their history as they've done so many times before. But this isn't an ordinary day. No, no, no. Now, when he came nigh to the gate of the city, and behold, there was a dead man carried out. Yes, yes, yes. Everybody's thinking we we do what we will with Yasserel. We're going to make his history, his truth, dead and carry it out. Remove it, if you will. Mm -hmm. The only son of his mother and she was a widow, and much people of the city were with her. And when the Lord saw her, he had compassion on her and said unto her, weep not, weep not. And he came and touched the buyer, and they that bear him stood still. You see, there's coming a time these nations are going to stand still because this is not a funeral they're about to witness, not a burial. It is a resurrection, beloved. It is a resurrection. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And Yeshua HaMashiach said unto him, young man, I say unto thee, arise, arise. Yes, yes, yes. Why do we know he has rule? He has rule. This young man is Yasharel here in the towns and the nations of our captivity that want to bury us. They think they've come to see a funeral. Many of the Yashraelites, they follow too, believing it is a funeral. No, beloved, no, you're in the midst of a resurrection and the one that's speaking to him. When you go to the book of Luke chapter one, verse 33, and he who, Yeshua HaMashiach, shall reign over the house of Jacob forever and of his kingdom, there shall be no end. You see, you cannot have him reigning and those he reigns over are dead. He is not the Yahuwah of the dead, but of the living. Mm. And he came and touched the buyer. I'm back in chapter seven. And they that bear him, these people are about to stand still. Yes, yes, yes. And he said, young man, I say unto thee, arise. You are about to see a resurrection. That is what we're seeing. That's why it's going on globally. That's why the nations are shaking off the heathens. That's why. Wait a minute. And he that was dead, mm, sounding like the valley of dry bones, when that word of the Lord went out. Mm -hmm. And he that was dead set up. Mm -hmm. The bones got the rattling. Yes, yes, yes. Mm-hmm. And he that was dead sat up and began to speak, and he delivered him to his mother. Wait a minute. Like we shall be delivered unto the land that was given to our ancestors. Yes, yes, yes. That so-called dead man represents Yasharel in the lands of their captivity. Mm -hmm. You see, they thought his mother was a widow, but we know. We can look in the book of Jeremiah and see Yahuwah is our father, is our is her husband. Yahuwah is married to Yasharet. Yes, yes, yes. And who shall reign over the house of Jacob forever? Mm. Yeshua Hamashiach, beloved, not the heathen, the heathen that wants to douse that eternal life. Yes, beloved. 
the more they try to quiet it, the louder it grows. Why? Because they think they came to see a funeral when what they're witnessing is a resurrection. Yes, yes, yes. Mm, mm, mm. And there came a great fear on all. Yes, yes. And they glorified God saying that a great prophet has risen among us and that Yah has visited his people. Yes, yes, yes. Great fear is coming on those heathen nations. Why? Because Yasharel is sitting up, hearing the word of the Most High, not dead. There is no funeral, but a resurrection. And every nation shall stand still and see he who reigns over the house of Jacob forever when that word goes out it is already speaking that's why the nations want to shake them off who those who thought they were hegemon and are hegemon no more their time to rule is over there is no funeral but a resurrection be encouraged beloved it is worth shalom